Welcome back to TYT Sports. Francis, Hassan, and Jason here with you. So, Jason Pierre-Paul, uh, July 4th fireworks accident. Uh, a lot of crazy sources and news came out over the past few months with Jason Pierre-Paul. What does his hand look like? We wanted to know. I'm not going to tease you anymore. New York Daily News finally released a photo of what his hand looked like. Let's take a look at what it looks like now. So, that is the... <laughs> Um, not for the uh, for the weak stomach, at least his his index finger gone, and this is the really cruel joke I'm gonna make, and it's probably not fair. No, no, but I'm no. going to anyway. If you've ever seen Scary, Scary Movie, Movie Two, that is what his hand looks Take like my exactly. Turkey. Yes. Take my <laughs> and the only reason I feel okay making fun of Jason Pierre Paul for this incident is because if you are that dumb to blow your hand off with a firework when you are in all-pro defensive end and the heart and soul of the New York Giants defensive line and at this point would have been the defense. And you are that dumb. Because that's the only way to put tackles, it. But is he getting tackles with his index finger? He ain't getting tack. He can't no. tackle anybody. He doesn't have an index finger. Yeah. <laughs> so so what, what, what position he plays again? Defensive end for the New York Giants. And that's basically... Your the way like your stability to hold yourself before you hike before the what I called it yesterday the hike the hike the hut the hut the, the hike. hut the like, hut the just, hut the hike so there's a few issues with this one he hasn't been able to work out and knowing that you two spend basically 23 hours a day in the gym uh the muscles flex can we get a shot of it yeah come on can we get a shot come of on. it can we get a shot of it come on oh ah. considering you guys spend all that time in the gym you know that if you can't work out you're gonna start slimming down you're not gonna be able to keep up the muscle mass in your body correct? like lebron preseason last year well <laughs> like lebron preseason that's a good point uh well he has been working out he posted a video to his instagram you can see it here no way around it i'm the problem and solution getting it if you want to know what i'm doing only talking beef when you boys barbecuing up some real niggas posts on the block patching you in. step by step i ain't got nothing left been learning the game i don't need no ref nigga too funny aka mike else all i know is work like my and as you can see he's trying to get back in shape but I mean, we don't know if that's a pre-injury or post-injury. No, you can see it's, it oh, you came out. Yeah, you can see okay. his hand, kind of. That's why the photos do us justice now. Now, again, the issue: Jason Pierre-Paul, again, 16 and a half sacks during the 20, 2011 Giants run for the Super Bowl. 12 and a half sacks last year. He is the defense for that team, and the team's going to suffer from it. There was so much else that happened with this, though. He refused to let Giants team doctors to see him after he blew off his hand. Maybe because of embarrassment. Maybe because he didn't want his franchise He's tag to be. And it was panic. Yeah, you That's just don't want too. you don't want anyone your, to, to yeah. take away your livelihood because of an incident that you did that was within your control. And your hand is blown up, so you're not you're probably not thinking clearly. Yeah. You're like, oh, fuck. I mean, to begin with, you did something incredibly stupid, so you're obviously not thinking clearly all the fucking time. Yeah. And then your hand is blown up, so you're not going to be like, oh, let me go to the Giants. Yeah, and especially like, like in, in suffering minor injuries in sports in college, like I would never go and see the trainer if I thought that it was going to be something that would hinder me for the next game. So I can't imagine if this guy with a multi-million dollar contract like, all right, I don't have a finger, definitely not going to be able to start. There's no way I'm going to go and see the doctor until I, I'm for sure knowing. It doesn't, this doesn't mean he can't play. I know, but this so is... So at least he's probably, sources say, not going to play this season yeah. and they might not be signed by the New York Giants because, by the way, when he blew off his hand, he was franchise tagged and looking to sign a multi-million dollar deal. I think he's losing million. about eight hundred thousand dollars, close to eight hundred thousand dollars every time, every, every week. week. That's crazy. Yeah, it's insane. So before the hike, this is an article I read before. I call it the hike because it's what they guys, what I think they say, Omaha, Omaha. Uh, oh that's the way they start, right? The starting position is their hand is on the ground. It's all balanced now. So mentally, he's going to be thrown off, right? Unless he gets some sort of prop. To hold he's himself not, in position. He's not. He's not. So, some him. defensive linemen don't line yeah. up like that. Okay. But have, but but fundamentally, most do. Fundamentally, I'm right. I'm. I'm just saying. I'm. I'm sure they're not going to make Hassan. him. <laughs> I'm not, all right. <laughs> I'm. I'm sure they're not going to put him in that position anymore. Well, I would hope not, unless he's a steel <laughs> rod as a finger. <laughs> I wonder, no. like, what what he thought when he didn't go to the Giants' doctors. Was he gonna show up to practice with just a prosthetic finger? Like, this is totally cool. It's yeah. Uh, leave your thoughts in the comment section <laughs> below. For those with the weak stomachs, what do you think of Jason Pierre-Paul's <laughs> hand? And thing? kids, don't play with fireworks. Oh. Yeah, seriously, do not play do with not fireworks. Play with fireworks. Uh, at Francis underscore Maxwell, at Hassan the Hunt, at Jason Rubin ninety one, at TYD Sports on Twitter. Don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe. All that good stuff. Good stuff. See you next time. I didn't know that there was a tagline.